So we have a perfect opportunity to really fuck up Muscovy right here. We saw that they declared war on the hordes of the south like we thought. I mean, we knew that Muscovy always has to declare war on those hordes, and that is when Muscovy is at its weakest point. We really have to do some big, big damage here because we could almost completely eliminate this threat that we have for the entire campaign. Now, I don't know where they are, but Muscovy still holds a pretty powerful army at 27,000. They're going to be losing their manpower very fast, but so are we. While sieging out these uh, Muscovonian provinces, it's going to be tough, and winter is coming. I do have um, some mercs handling the hardest provinces that there are. Uh, let me go and send this. St oh, we already are sending that six second. Okay. Uh, yeah, so this guy is suffering from plus one, uh, plus one from just the... Uh, attrition from just the arctic but it, wait just wait just wait when we get into uh the winter months it's gonna be insane oh this guy's fighting these guys without any leader that's a little bit scary but we're okay we are okay okay let me split them up i think i might even go a little bit ballsy here it is ballsy fort level i think this i think they're gonna be okay but we'll see is this guy just standing there no he's, he's not just standing there I don't want to split up too much. Oh, there is the, uh, let's, let's, hopefully, let's hopefully the Vonian Order take care. Oh, that's a two-star, though. That is a two-star. Let, let's, uh, hold on, let me see. Are we going to get there in time? 12th of September, yes. And hopefully Livonian Order does take care of, no, or maybe Poland instead. Please, Poland, take care of this, this guy that's sieging out my vassal. It's just a vassal, not that big of a deal, but still. It's still something. Still want to be somewhat careful. All right, so there are a bunch of troops being, like, uh, I, I guess, built all throughout these lands. I'm seeing all these, like, one stacks starting to pop up everywhere. I don't like that too much. Where are you going now? I'll try to I'll try to wipe as many as we can so that, you know, obviously if, once they blob out, that's it's kind of a bad thing when they blob out. Okay, let's chase you down. Is there anything else? Is there, there any other enemy, ter enemy, enemy people? Poland, let's go. You have military access, right? I'm pretty sure you do. You've, you've got to. Offer military access. There. Yes. Okay, so go for it. Make sure you go through my lands. I don't know if you had it before, but you got it now. Um, maybe I should even ask for your military access. I don't know. My three stacks should be okay, right? Okay, it's October, so November is coming. I need to be ready for that. I really hope that the hordes are preoccupying Muscovy right now. Because if not, there's, there's going to be an attack on my eight stack here. They are technically winning both of their wars. A lot better with the Golden Horde. Technically, they're only winning our war by one, one war score. That's not that significant. Poland, go, buddy. Go for it. Go, buddy. I'm going to let Poland do the, the dirty work. I'm not going to do it. Oh, shit. Son of a biznitch. Those damn rebels. Fucking nationalists, man. So, will someone take care of them for me, though? No, of course, they're just going to let him walk by. Crap. Alright, so what I'm going to do is hopefully siege out as much as I can here. Oh god, the 19 sacks coming for me. Of course they are. Of course they are. So where, where, where are you going? First of all, where are you going? You're going here. Okay. You're going right here, 17th of December. I can, I can pull you off. I can pull you off. I don't really want to pull... Hmm. I don't really want to pull off the guy that, that sieged out the capital, obviously. Okay, so I'll wait for the 16th and I'll move everyone else in. Poland's not going to get there in time. Okay, well, at least, at least I got rid of... Uh... Oh, there they go. Okay, whoops. Okay, we're daylight. No big deal. We still... I think, I think we're going to be okay. Uh, maybe not. I'm not fighting with any leaders. I'm, I'm technically... I don't have the numbers in this battle. Not yet. I will. I'll have slightly more numbers. And if someone gets here in time, that'll help us out. Hopefully Livonian... The, 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 the Livonian order hopefully start to help us out here. We're about to finish off the siege of this capital. Oh, six attrition. Jeez. Holy crap. Okay, good. So that was a big battle that we just won there. Let's combine and split. Um, I'm going to be losing a lot of manpower very, very soon. As long as we get our... Uh-oh. Okay, move in there. I don't want you to even come close to engaging. Another 19 stack. When are we going to get there, though? Oh, crap. 
That, oh shit, I hope that one sec doesn't get wiped. Yep, he just got totally wiped out. Son of a bitch. Alright, hordes, you better start doing shit. It's so, so do you, Poland. You need to start doing shit. I'm gonna combine, detach, and run in there. I don't think we, we... Oh, man, we don't have the morale. Okay, so I'm going to keep these guys there. We'll have Poland take care of them. They're going to be weak. They're, they're going to be weak. Poland's going to run in there. I don't think he's going to get there in time. I doubt it. Of course not. Come on. No, he's, there's no way. Yep, there it goes. Okay, so it's going to send us back to our territory. Somewhat back to our territory. That's okay. We needed to go back anyways. We got to take care of this 16,000 fucking rebels. Piece of shit. That makes me so frustrated. You have no idea how mad that makes me. You know, even if we just have to release a bunch of their vassals and release a bunch of, like, Novgorod or something, like, that's fine. I'm not really trying to take anything from this war. Uh, I, I'm, I'm just trying to... Um, all I'm trying to do is just weaken Muscovy significantly. And I think hopefully Poland is going to be able to do a lot of that for me. I hope so. So you guys are a little bit more powerful than you look, right? I hope so. Okay, Livonian Order is doing shit. I like that they're doing stuff. We better get over there fast or else we're going to be suffering from some nationalism in that in that whole area. Oh, man. We've got a lot of reinforcing to do. At least, we'll get, at least we're going to get a hold of one province. And I think Poland's going to take care of the rest. Is this, the, is this, wait a second, is this the core? This is the claim that we have on, right? Are they sieging? Damn it, they're sieging out our claim. Okay, I don't like that, but at least it's 19,000. They're going to keep us safe. And more Polish troops are going for it. Oh, nice. All right, all right. I didn't, I didn't, I forgot about all this stuff that we're sieging out. Perfect. Okay, good. So it's not as bad. We lost, we lost the siege of the capital, so that, that kind of sucks, but it could be way worse. Could be way, way worse. I'm going to detach enough to siege because I really got to take these guys down. Really got to take these, these guys down. Let me, let me pay attention. Pay attention to any sort of Muscovonian troops coming at us. They've got to be weak. They, they've got to be weak. Come on. Where are they at? All right. So I've got to scroll a little bit. 15,000. Their manpower is at six, seven, uh, 60. What is that? 6,500. Ah, son of a bitch. Fuck you guys, man. These stupid. That was a 1.2 chance of them uprising. That's some bullshit. Seriously. That, that makes me so frustrated. Okay, good. So there goes one. I'm going to try to get another one. Hopefully I'm able to siege out the capital, not Poland. I'd, I'd like that. And let's go handle these sons of bitches. Hungary has declared war on Kiev. Uh-oh. Kiev might be gone. You have a general, right? Yeah, you have a general. So make sure you guys both run in there, run in, run in there at the same time. I'm loving this uh, these, uh, these mercs. These mercs are really saving us from so much attrition up there. Do not tell me you're going to lose this. Do not lose this. Come on. I'm, I'm only getting a little bit of rough terrain. I've got the numbers here. Do not. Do not do it. I'm fucking freaking out. <gasps> oh my gosh. I was about to lose my freaking shit. You guys have no idea how much I would have lost my shit if we lost that. Oh my god, I was going to so freaking lose it. You have no idea. You guys seriously have no idea how much I was going to fucking lose it if we lost that. Alright, so we're losing a lot of money. I should probably raise war taxes. Uh, yeah, we, we can go ahead and afford to raise some war taxes. Get a little bit more money back. Wow, yeah, we're losing so much. Livonian's doing good. My mercs up top here are just being the lifesaver. Just a lifesaver. Okay, let's, let's make sure we move. Uh-oh. Where are you going, buddy? Don't. Okay, you're moving down south. I'm a little bit worried there. Hopefully Poland is... Are you, where are you moving exactly? Okay, you're, you're going to war with... Who are you moving towards? Yeah, I'm going to re reinforce my two-stack here because I f have a feeling you're going to attack my two-stack then, rather than anything else. Go after them, Poland. Don't let them, don't let them go. Also, you know, Golden Horde, you better be doing something here. You're losing this badly still, even though I've, got, I've totally got them preoccupied. What the hell are you guys doing? What the, what, what, what's going on? Uh, they're totally preoccupied with what we've got sending at them. The fact that you... I don't know. I don't understand this. Um, the uh, Muscovonian capital is up for grabs. 
We might want to think about that. Am I, I'm improving relations with the Livonian Order. I should probably continue to do that. I'm going to continue. Well, I can't improve with these guys anymore. Who else can I improve with? I should probably fabricate a claim on Genoa. Yeah, it sounds... Oh, actually, Crimea. Even better, Crimea. All right, boom. Yeah, let's do that while we have just a diplomat just sitting there. Holy crap. I, I'm still just kind of on it about that damn... Those damn rebels. All right, so you're about to go and attack my friend. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to combine you, and we're going to chase you down. January 9th. Uh-oh, it is winter. They're going to be suffering from some attrition. Here we go. Look at this five... Actually, not so much in, in these lower provinces from up here, though. Holy crap. Normal winter. Okay, so it hasn't got to the severe yen winter yet. Arctic, yeah. So they're suffering from, like, one and then two from the normal winter. I mean, geez. Four attrition there. It gets pretty, it gets pretty rough. Please tell me you're continuing to move. I don't want to engage you. We're, we're not going to beat them there, right? Oh, we are. Okay, don't don't beat them there. Here, I'll go around. I'll go around. Are you? Oh, God. Did that siege stop? I don't think so. Okay, so now I'm going to chase them. I think it did. I just hope they don't do anything to our mercs. All right, Poland. We got to go in after them. And I hope that they engage you first. Oh, you're, are you, are you going to be preoccupied with... Uh, I'm not sure, but there you go. Hey, did they give this to us? Oh, nice. Good. Thank you, Poland. They totally gave us our, uh, our claim there. That was nice of them. Here, I'll, I'll, I'll engage this 11 sec if we can. Oh, oh, they did. Okay. So there should be a big battle here. Wait a second. What are we suffering? Am I going to cause us to get a crossing penalty? R no. Okay, so there shouldn't be any crossing penalty. Uh, currently, there's no... We're not getting any penalties at all. For So we should be able to be good to go to... To, to run in there. Nice. All right. Poland and Lithuania working together. You don't see that every day. Yes, you do. Uh-oh, they're going for my one stack. Oh, no, they're not. Okay. Whew. I was about to have to chase these dudes down. All right, Poland. So if you want to take out this 19,000 Muscovonian troops, then that, that'd be awesome. All right, now it's 20,000. No, 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 no. Don't, don't, don't let them on siege. It's in the woods, and we would cross a river. <sighs> Here, I'm going to try to get them to come attack us in their capital. They're, they're not going to want us to... Oh, okay, nice. The Ottomans have left the coalition. That was the final one that we really, really needed. Uh, and the Livonian Order is doing a great job. Sieging that stuff out. I've still got a while to go. I've got to take out this... Damn nationalists. Um, how's these going? Good, good, good. Wow. Wow, this Merc, this Merc idea has worked so good. Oh, shit, the attrition. Oh, six, okay, 6%. Not bad. All right, so maybe I'll try to draw them in. If I split them up, yep, they're going to do it. And more than likely, uh, Poland's going to come help us out. So as soon as... You, what, what, when are you going to get there? June 7th? So I'll even give you some time. Uh, this guy does have two maneuvers, so we're going to get there a little bit faster than, than expecting. All right, let's go and take them down. So we are getting a... De oh, no, they're not getting any penalties. Shit. I thought they would. Oh, we're in grasslands. Well, at least we... At least... I mean, this is technically probably the best because we, we would have gotten a, an offensive attacking penalty if we would have attacked them um, while they were trying to unsiege the claim that we have against them that Poland just gave to us. So that was, that was still kind of a good idea. It could have been better. Obviously, it could have been a little bit better. All right, and I'm going to continue to sit here and stay on top of their capital. If I siege out their capital, we're going to be getting a lot of points. A lot of points. So where did we just finish up? Nice. Awesome. So we're getting away from that Arctic territory, so not as much attrition are we, we're going to be uh, suff uh, suffering from. Oh, my gosh. My ducats. That's terrifying. I've lost 20,000 men in this war. My manpower was at 50,000. I'm at 30,000, and we're still not even done. We're only at 33 wars. Tour. We still have a lot more to go. Okay, so, um, Hordes, you better get on your shit. You're still losing this war, but Muscovy's looking really, really weak right now. Muscovy, I mean, you guys should make your offensive right now. Where, where, look at this. Look how far I've got to scroll down. Where the hell are they? I don't even know where they're at. I might have passed them, though. Uh, let me just search by... I wish there was a damn search tool. F Muscovy or something. Muscovy, oh my gosh, they're at almost, barely under 5,000 men. Yes, this is perfect. And if Poland continues to give me all their, their provinces, their, their siege out, this is going to be amazing. 
all of the the coalition is done um, all the aggressive expansion is good as well so I can I can afford to take a lot of land if I want here if I really wanted to I could I could take a lot of land oh man okay so okay there it goes so they reinforce enough I should probably sp no I'm, I'm not gonna risk well they only have 5,000 troops left and Poland is right next to me so I guess I will risk it I'm gonna split these guys up even though they're sieging out the capital uh, and let's siege out a few more. I don't know if Poland is going to continue to give me all of these uh, provinces. Just giving them to myself as Lithuania. But I don't really want to take the risk. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do. Okay, Dipl diplomatic te technology. I'm just so glad that we didn't get screwed and we weren't in Regency Council while Muscovy uh, declared war on the Golden Horde. So I feel pretty good about this. Uh, I'm actually going to hopefully take a lot out of this war. I don't mind aggressive expansion because more than likely we're going to get into Regency Council. My king is probably going to die. A little bit premature. Uh, so I need to kind of think about that and take as much as I can in this first war. Yeah, if we, we just got to take as much as we can here and expect to be uh, at peace for the next like 10 years or something like that. Also, how is the... Uh, I know that I was suffering from a diplomatic reputation penalty because I had annexed my... Vassal. Still suffering from it. I believe it's like 10 years or something like that. We just allied, or we just annexed Finland, so I'm sure we still have a while to go. I guess I can uh, increase the speed to speed 4. Alright, so now we're pretty much perfect. It doesn't matter if the Golden Horde and Poland decide to drop out of this war. We'd be fine. We'd be absolutely fine. Hey, we're making some positive numbers now. Oh, shit. Are you, are you moving up north? Alright. So we're going to lose these these 3,000 men. Yeah, there's nothing we can do about it. I just hope that Poland goes and, and, and engages. I just hope Poland goes and, and, and engages. That, that would be the best thing. Okay, I, I'm just going to have to lose them. There's nothing really else I can do about that. Good, we've gained claim on Crimea. I'm going to want to send them over to Genoa or something. Where are you going? 17,000 men. What the hell happened? Oh, well, a lot of you... Oh, so a lot of Georgian men, a lot of your vassals, stuff like that. So don't try to unseed shit. Just come down here and fight me. So hopefully Pol Poland joins in and stuff like that. That would be, that would be good. Oh, you're splitting your shit up. Okay, probably not the best idea. Yeah, probably not the best idea. Okay, we've got to finish some of this stuff. Come on, guys, finish some of this stuff. And and okay, we can't go to speed five. That's a little bit ridiculous. Oh oh damn, you just declared war on a. Uh, Georgia, who we want to declare war on. Looks like looks like the Golden Horde is slowly pushing back, at least when it comes to Georgia. Let me go ahead and fabricate a claim on Genoa. I definitely want this province at some point. Oh my gosh, I'm at 22,000 men now. This is scary. Since these guys can't even annex that stuff anyway. Okay, so what, what are you guys going to do? You're just going to start to try to take back shit, or what? I should probably go and engage while Poland is still here. They're still in the war. I wasn't thinking about their vassals. I, I forgot about that whole thing. Well, how much do they have left? We still have quite a bit more men than they, than they, than they do. I guess I'll lose the prestige since I should be getting a lot of prestige after winning this war. I should, theoretically. We're still sieging stuff out. And as soon as we get the capital, then I'm good. I, I'm good. When we get the capital, then I think we'll be fine. Livonian order, get your shit together and get over here. Seriously. Golden Horde has 12,000 men. I like that. Um, okay. Okay, nice. So we finished one. Uh, more than likely, so there's a forest here, so they will get... We will suffer a penalty from attacking. Okay, a few more things. Only a few more. Okay, come on. Poland, go after them. We, I will support you, buddy. There goes another one. Okay. Oh, good. That was the capital, too. 52 war score. Awesome. So... They should theoretically come and try to unseize their capital before anything else. Uh oh, it is nearing winter. I don't know if I want to sit here during winter time, but I'm not sure exactly if how much longer I could let them unseize. I mean, we're sieging stuff out a lot faster because we're smarter and we're carpet sieging. So that's that's part of the goodness. I don't really want to suffer. I don't want to be the one that's attacking. To be honest, I don't want to have to be. The, the, the one that's doing the dirty work. All right, guys, looks like I'm going to have to stop right there. I'm going to go ahead and raise the war taxes once again. I'm going to do something about this 25,000 men. Once we do that, I think we're going to be good. We got their capital. I want 100% war score. If we can, I want 100% war score. I might just let them, just let them do it. 
go ahead and unsiege it. Who cares? You're going to be suffering from so much attrition with 25,000 men sitting on this province, especially when winter's rolling around. You're going to be in some trouble. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.